So first, uh, I'd just like to say I am sick, um, so that might explain if I sound uh, goofier than normal, um, but I wanted to talk a little bit today about the Torrid Meteor Stream, and I only, thanks to Ancient Apocalypses, uh, or Ancient Apocalypse, I just learned that we go through the Torrid Meteor Stream every year. And that during this period of time that usually starts around uh, October and goes through November, um, we go through this stream every year and some meteor fragments come down. Um, scientists say that it's associated with the uh, comet called NK, um, but I don't know exactly all about that. You know, too much uh, other than the fact that we literally have a debris stream that the Earth goes through every year. And quite frankly, I think that's a little bit horrifying because how many chunks of rock are out there that might be large enough to actually do substantial damage to the planet? Um, that's one of the big theories of the Ancient Apocalypse show is that meteor fragments came flying down and hit the earth and there's evidence of that with the uh, black mat which is burned soil um, so my wondering is exactly how did that uh, you know torrid meteor stream occur um, is it possible that two comets could have collided could this have this comet hit the earth and its debris uh, you know been here beforehand it's a crazy idea to think about such a thing um, but i think it's also kind of neat but also kind of terrifying um, so i guess uh, if you live in an area that doesn't have too much ambient light especially at night you might be able to see some of these meteor fragments because for the most part they're pretty small and a lot of them just burn up on their way through the atmosphere but some of them might be pretty large. Um, I'll have to do a little bit more reading into it and look into everything because it's pretty neat. Um, but again, uh, I guess uh, this is just me again talking about uh, Ancient Apocalypse being such a crazy, amazing show. Um, but, you know, you don't have to watch it and believe that there was some ancient civilization you can just go and watch the visuals of all the different places that he went and explored. Um, but the idea of the meteor being uh, hitting the earth, um, I have another uh, idea that I'll talk about in the next video probably about what could cause mass flooding um, and just theorizing on it. Uh, but uh, you probably, if you like this kind of video, you might have already watched Randall Carlson go over this, which is uh, another person that is highly fantastic to watch. And he's right here on YouTube. But uh, yeah, that's it for today.